General Omar Nelson Bradley, an American officer not talked about or examined enough. Omar Bradley started off his military career by attending and graduating West Point Military Academy in New York in 1915. At the outbreak of the Second World War, Bradley was placed in command of the 2nd Army Corps for the North Africa Campaign under General Patton. In May 1943, he achieved his first success when he captured the town of Bizerte in Tunisia. This victory led to the fall of Tunisia and the surrender of around a quarter million Axis troops. Bradley then went on to Sicily where he found more success against the retreating German army. After the conclusion of that campaign, he was called back to Britain to command the 1st Army. While there, he was placed under the command of British General Montgomery and helped plan the Normandy invasion. He was then made the commander of the U.S. Army 12th Group, which made him the American officer with the most men under his command in the field in American history. After the war, he would go on to become the first chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. He would then go on to retire from the Army in 1953 with the conclusion of the Korean War. Bradley was well liked by his men for being humble and having a special understanding of their situation and hardships, earning him the nickname, the G.I.'s General.